You're watching FloridaDaily.net, and I'm Kemp Parr. We're at Surfaces 2019, first day of the show, and we're in the U.S. floor space, and I'm with Pete Doshe, the president of U.S. Floors, and also the executive vice president of all of Shaw's Hard Surface products, right? Yes, good morning, Kemp, and welcome again, you know? Yeah, Pete, we've been seeing each other a lot lately, traveling to, to Germany and all these different shows. Do you know what day it is? I think it's Wednesday, January the 23rd, if I'm not mistaken, but indeed, I mean, we've been almost roommates over yeah. the last couple of weeks traveling over the world. I mean, Hanover, Washington, Chicago, Dallas, whatever it is, but, uh, and even in Orlando last weekend, so, right. but it's been good. That's right, and yeah. we both got here last night, so yeah. uh, here we are today. Yeah. So first, before we get into the products, because you've got a lot of exciting things to talk about, again, leading with innovation, but tell us how business was for this category with Cortec brand in 2018. We had a very strong year in, in 2018. Um, Shaw overall as a company grew um, uh, very nicely both on the top and the bottom line. As a matter of fact, we had our strongest year ever in the history of the of the company. Um, high single digit growth, so we, we're really proud about that. And, and that's across the entire uh, category. Obviously the uh, LVP, the um, rigid core uh, products have exceeded that growth quite uh, phenomenal. Um, and it's been uh, we've, we've again seen um, you know double digit high double digit growth in that segment uh, to the point whereby by the end of um, 18 we, we believe that the momentum is going to continue to drive 19 as well there's no stopping to this category i think it's still in its um, in its early stages uh, actually i think you're modest because you say double digit i think it's double with a two in front of it so it's fantastic right? actually it's a bigger number than two yeah. oh it is yes. oh, fantastic yes. so would you say you're the market share leader in this category of rigid core clearly we are yes yeah. clearly we are the, the 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 whole industry has grown quite significant so everyone here in this hall has benefited from that um but you know our our momentum our growth and the support that we've been getting from the dealers not just for the products but as well for the brand because the brand continues to to profile itself as the, the strongest brand in, in that segment uh, has really uh, continued to make us the market leader in this category. And, and, and we take that serious. We, we, we are proud of that, but at the same time we take it serious because we feel that, you know, as the originators of this category, we have an obligation to make sure that the category continues to, to remain profitable, innovative, creative, so that all of our dealer partners and the whole industry can continue to benefit from that. Mm -hmm. You know, the visuals are one of the reasons that you're, I mean, it's, the construction's good. The visuals are fantastic. You know, I've told you that. I know this is anecdotal, but let me tell you real quick again. I, I went to about a $4 million house in North Chattanooga recently, and they had Cortec all throughout. And you, you, you wouldn't have known it if you hadn't asked somebody. It was gorgeous floors. And so it's going in on you know, some really luxury homes now. Yeah, no question. I think um, the visuals are always the first thing that, of course, is going to sell the product. And, and because of the construction and the, you know, the, 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 the beauty, of, beauty of, the, of, the, of the product, it's really penetrating in all segments and in all price levels of the housing market. Um, you know, we have now products that are 12 millimeter thick, half an inch. I mean, they're really the, 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 the hand and the strength and the beauty of a real engineered wood floor. Um, so yeah, I mean, there's no telling and there's no limit to where the, where the ceiling is for what price point and what house in the market. So, uh, it doesn't surprise me, but that's yeah. great to hear. As a matter of fact, we'd love to have some pictures from that house. Yeah. Okay, all right, all right. So, Pete, tell me about Cortex Stone. I know that's the most exciting thing you're doing here. Yeah, we have uh, quite a few introductions here this week, and, and we've shown it in the last couple of weeks as well in the regional shows. But the most important thing that we're showing uh, this week is the Cortex Stone innovation. Um, again, a beautiful collection of ceramic tile, marble, limestone, uh, um, um, concrete looking uh, decors uh, in a construction that really solves solutions or brings solutions, solves problems that our dealers have when they uh, look at the installation of ceramic tile. And, and every time you bring beautiful products that bring solutions to the market, um, you know, almost every time you have a winner. And we believe again that with this Cortex Stone, we're, we're moving the bar, we're bringing innovation in the ceramic tile segment of the, of the industry. Let me set the stage real quick. I've heard this presentation a few times. Actually, your brother at Domatech showed me a video. I think there's 13 billion 
uh, square meters of flooring sold every year. 60% of that's tile in the world, okay? Yep. And now you've got a product. I mean, for a lot of times we thought about Cortec as being a wood product, but now you have a stone product. And not only is it the visual, and by the way, you get, you're getting these visuals by shooting Italian tile products, so yep. they're upper end visuals. But, uh, but it's got a core that's a mineral core that looks like a, almost a concrete product, right? Yeah, I mean, I, every year I say the same thing, Camp. I need to hire you as one of our salespeople. <laughs> you do an excellent job explaining. Yeah. But, but it's true. I mean, um, yeah, Cortec basically has been known for more the wood visuals. We've had some uh, tile uh, visuals in Cortec, but those were basic tile decors that were not specifically uh, designed for that segment. We went to Italy, we went to Italian designers, we looked at what's selling in the market. We brought those designs back to our Cortec stone construction, and now we're bringing out 40 SKUs, of which uh, nine are in a high gloss and uh, 31 in a more of a more uh, matte uh, type of finish uh, to the market in, in all different sizes. And, and, and again, I think we've we moved the bar. Um, and from a WPC, SPC, we are now talking about a mineral core, which is the, the base of, of that Cortex stone, a mineral core where there's no uh, plasticizer, there's no PVC in that core. So again, it makes for an ultra stable, waterproof type of core, the closest thing to a cement type like uh, finish. Or, or, or core for for that matter. So um, again, I think we've, we've we've moved the bar to the next level, uh, and specifically constructed a product that mimics ceramic tile, basically 100%. So you're not going to rest on your laurels. You're going to continue to innovate. This is innovation, but you've got yet another one to talk about. So tell us about the multi-layered floor you're rolling out with a real hardwood top. Yeah. So just like uh, Cortex Stone, uh, where we use that mineral core as the base for the for the construction, we use the same mineral core and we, um, we basically apply a, a two millimeter wood sliced wood veneer on top of that core to make, for, to make a beautiful wide long plank waterproof engineered wood floor. Again, um, a first in the market uh, with that construction. I mean, we've seen SPC with wood veneers uh, already in the market, but we believe that again, we have mimicked as close as you can the real engineered wood flooring uh, products in a waterproof format, very stable, very long, very wide. Well, and it qualifies under the new NWFA standards as being real hardwood floors, right? Uh, yes, it does. Yes, yeah. I mean, exactly. That's the, that's the good thing about that as well. It does qualify under those standards. So um, we're, really, we're really excited about that. I mean, both introductions are going to be phenomenal. Um, and we, we see that, that, you know, again, we're not just bringing gimmick products, we don't just bring kind of, we making, we bringing products that make sense. And if you can bring products that make sense and the, the dealer will, the dealer will embrace it, the consumer will embrace it and it will be successful. And, and that's what we always do. I love innovation. Innovation is the backbone of, of, of a company, of our industry. I mean, that's where we set ourselves apart. I mean, we've always been innovators. We've always been creative. We've always been disruptors um, and not just disruptors for the sake of it, but bringing solutions. I, I go back to that same point, bringing solutions is really what it's all about. And we know installation is an issue, labor is an issue. So with Cortex Stone, we bring the beautiful visuals in a format that can be installed and bring the solutions to the market. Mm -hmm. So it's been two years now since Shaw Industries bought U.S. Floors, and I don't think you'd have been able to pull this off without that financial backing, would you? Listen, indeed, it has already been two years. Sometimes I wonder where the time uh, went, but um, uh, I mean, it's been a, a fantastic partnership, a fantastic uh, opportunity for us to grow the company, uh, not only just the financial segment. Um, you know, you can always go to banks and borrow money, and sure, with, with, with Shaw as a financial partner, as a, uh, we, we obviously that, that issue was off the table right away, but it's more than financial uh, strength. I mean, the whole team is fantastic. We, they've embraced. U.S. Floors and Cortec into their um, into their family uh, with, with open arms, and we've had access to the entire enterprise from a distribution, from a logistics, from a finance, from a customer service, from a from an IT technology, from a um, uh, marketing. So uh, it's a combination of all these uh, departments and all these people that really profiled us to uh, this incredible growth that we've seen in the last two years. I mean, um, I thought it was growing fast before uh, the show acquisition. But the last two years has really propelled us in a whole different uh, segment, and it's been a great, um, a great um, partnership—not a partnership, a great uh, family 
uh, coming together, so to speak. So what's, what's your outlook for 19? We are positive on 19. I mean, we had a fantastic 18, uh, no question there. Um, you know, do we think that 19 is going to be as strong as, um, as, as 18? Probably not, because the numbers were very strong in 18. Uh, obviously, there's a lot of noise right now that is, um, that is basically um, um, disturbing a little bit the, 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 the consumer's uh, stability, the market stability. Yeah. We talk, when you look at the news, if all that noise comes down, the market will be, be good, the market will continue to be uh, strong in 19. We, have, we are bullish. Yeah. Um, all this new introduction will be strong in the growth segment, will be the later part, of course, of the year, because you know, by the time the samples hit the, hit the field, but you know, we, we're positive on, on 2019, just like we were absolutely um, excited about coming out of a, a fantastic 2018. All right, well, Pete, uh, beautiful space here. You've got, it looks like another spaceship flying over here. I mean, you're bringing everybody in with this uh, TV screen. You've done a great job. You not only have great products, but you know how to build brands. So congratulations well, on all that. Again, thank you very much. And I, I, I think, you know, we need to create excitement. When we have these shows, it's all about creating excitement. I mean, that's how our industry is doing well right now. We have an obligation not only with products, but as well with excitement to make sure that we continue to lift uh, the, the momentum and to, to lift our industry to higher levels. So that's part of it. It's not just a show, it's let's create excitement. And yeah. the same thing is gonna happen, I believe, in, uh, in Atlanta, when Domatex Atlanta will have their first show. Again, we will be presenting there. I think it's an important opportunity for us again to showcase further on the East Coast. Um, so we will be present there, and I'm sure, Camp, like always, I'll be there. I will see you there <laughs> yeah, again. Exactly. So it's my right. pleasure. Okay, Thank Pete, you, it's good to talk to you again. Yes, been sir. talking to Pete Doshe, the president of U.S. Floors and the executive vice president of Shaw's Hard Surface Business, and you've been watching Kempar and FloorDaily.net.